Ever since I reviewed the ESCO 16x9 video attachment, the only 1.33 anamorphic I was missing was the SLR Magix. Now that I got it here, I wrote a very simple and straightforward script, then got a ton of help and patience from my friends while shooting this side project, which mixes all 1.33 attachments in unmarked shots to see if we can actually tell the difference between them. Thank you very much, Nico and Ariana. You guys are the best. Shooting this was all kinds of crazy, since I was constantly swapping taking lenses, anamorphics and diopters for every single shot. So keeping track of which shot had which combination was a complex task, but not as challenging as shooting the whole thing in a single Saturday afternoon. It was also my first time using Rob's Kin Mini, so I took full advantage of the Super 35 sensor plus speed booster to match full frame and shot the whole thing in 4K cinema DNGs without having to worry about crop factors and math. The crop factor is 1.066, which I'm considering full frame. Telling which shot used which lens without looking at my notes turned out to be a much more difficult than I expected. And a few of them are easy to guess thanks to more visible uh, features like the SLR Magic Super Blue Flares or the Panasonic's wideness and pore edges, or the ESCO's Ovo Bokeh. But when these features are not so visible in the shot, it is blind luck trying to tell which lens was used. Check the chart below for the full specs, and how many did you get right? Which ones are your favorite shots? Before I end this video, I would like to point out the amazing score composed by my friend João Gabriel Rodrigues. He came up with this music from the most bizarre set of notes I could have wrote about the mood I wanted for this project. So if you're looking for good music, he's a freelancer and he works super fast. So you should definitely get in touch. What did you think of this method for reviewing lenses and putting them against each other? Leave a comment below, subscribe to the channel, and then stop by the blog for a whole lot more of anamorphic content like this shirt. And I'll see you soon. Tschüss, out.